It's not about me. It's about the book. This is a special preview of Z is for zero. Zero is for out of time. No portion of this preview can be reproduced. Z is for zero. Zero is for out of time. Written by Arthur S. Newman. Narrated by Sky Alley. Out of time. Letter four. In a special report just before your mother died, she said that she was working on the last book in her series. She also stated that she would release this book in her customary fashion. We know the book exists. So why are you holding back from the fans what is rightfully our due? You will give us no choice but to protest your staunch position. We beg of you to reconsider your position. Letter 5. Understand this is not a suggestion that you can easily ignore. We the fans demand a satisfactory resolution to the gaping hole that has been left in the lives of so many fans of your mother. We will be forced to take radical and definite steps if you do not find a way to accommodate our previous request. Letter 6. The pen is mightier than the sword, but if the sword is necessary to get the pen to take action, then that is your choice. Letter 7. You have had a year to respond to my request for the final novel in the series that your mother had been working on for most of her life. I am truly sorry for your loss, but as a fan, your mother, Annie Reeves, made a commitment to her fans that has gone unfulfilled. Drastic measures must be taken. Chapter 3. The Kidnapping The buzzing was a familiar sound. To most, the flying object would be unidentifiable. UFO. He laughed. The sound had been present for a little under a mile. Now the object hovered over his vehicle. It was apparent to him that this was no coincidence. This must be a practical joke. I'm on to you guys. He yelled and then started laughing again. When the gauges in his electric car started to malfunction, he wondered if it was because of the object flying above. Our units do not interfere with the electronics of other devices. What is going on? When his car just died without warning, it became apparent that he was a victim of foul play. His laughter subsided, and his thoughts flashed from one scenario to another. Picking up his phone to call 911 was a futile endeavor. His phone, too, was malfunctioning and made an odd sound as its screen went dark. Then, in front of him, appeared a bright light. The light filled the entire car. He peered at it through his windshield and his rearview mirror, then out the passenger door and driver door mirrors. Z is for zero. Zero is for out of time.